up and down the pole working trying to get her bands up her nigga was jealous so she had to give her mans up fuck niggas getting money became the anthem cause she was a Right now, I'm kind of rushy. I'm in, I'm in, I'm in the car, baby. I'm in the mood right now. If you haven't noticed, this is a travel vlog. My lips is in issue, but and my face breaking out, but that's okay. Like a bitch just got off birth control, been on there for seven years, and my body don't even know how to act. But that's okay, baby, because I'ma love you. But right now, I'm in Raleigh, North Carolina. Um, I'm at um, I forgot. If y'all haven't noticed, it's a travel vlog. So a girl was packing, dropped the baby y'all. <sighs> Thinking like, damn, do I got everything the whole time? I don't even got all my makeup. So I'm, I stopped at this place called Ultra Beauty in Raleigh, North Carolina. Um, okay, mention, um, I just got a notification for the party I will be at tonight. South Carolina is the vlog, baby. So yeah. I'm um, sitting in my car, actually about to go into the beauty world. I need to get two things. I can't remember the second thing, but I'm going to figure out when I get in there. Oh, I need some setting powder and I need some more foundation. Because like when I say I used all of it last night, baby. And I'm going to try to go get my nail done tomorrow. I ain't even going to try to push to say like, oh, I'm going to go get my nail done today. Because it's already 2.52 and I got to drive like three and a half hours. So, yeah. Who looking at the nail anyway? Besides y'all. But yeah, if you haven't noticed already, baby, like a, like I said before, this is a travel vlog and we're about to get to it. And if you can't accept me and my body or my rag and my face looking like this, don't accept me when I turn into Coco, baby. That's what I mean. That's what I said. Bye, mom. But make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe and stay tuned, baby, because um, I think I'm going to do three days. Stay tuned. Baby. Hotel. Mm -hmm. I'm so short, sure y'all can't even see. It's mad hotel. It's mad stuff. It's a Starbucks too. It's mad food. <laughs> y'all. Let me show y'all when I get in there. Okay, y'all getting the first views with me. It's like mm, I don't know. Just a closet, okay. Just so refrigerating. Okay. Like oh mirror. The little snacks. Okay, let me find something out. Oh lot is six forty nine. I mean fifty nine. But, um, switches now. 
Okay. But this the bed. The sitting area, office, the TV, and the bed. Just enough for little old me. I'm gonna get this popping. This is my view. And I'm about to take me a little 30. Cause your girl just pushed y'all but right here. If anybody know me, know I gotta have my ear on, oh, baby. You ain't gotta be that long. We can do like 70. Mm -mm, let me figure out how to cut some damn lights on. Get myself situated. Um, My dance bag is still in the car. There's no need for me to bring that up. Everything's situated how they need to go. Oh man, thank you. I'm about to take me with 30. And don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with it. Sign on. Yes, um, all right, y'all, I'll be back. That's how I get my life. Okay, this the fit. Makeup is done. What do I do? Well, I don't know how to. This the hair. Quick weave, little JT inspired, they say. Let me just show. Yeah, so I'm a little late. It's like 10.06. I was supposed to pregame or whatever with the crew. But baby, I had to take me a little nap. If y'all want me to be any kind of good when I um don't mind the bathroom child baby. But makeup. Yeah. Whew. I'm a little nervous, but baby, ain't nothing to do with it. Ain't nothing to it, but the mother can do it, okay? So yeah. Watched I don't know about y'all, but do y'all put um like think the towel or something in the bathroom when y'all um they y'all was coming for me like here with my damn vape yes i'm a vape kind of girl baby like but yeah i'm a little late so i'm gonna go ahead and go i'm really like 10 minutes from the damn place so i'm about to stop by the store give me a little wine or something kill my nerves crackhead moment roll up and we're gonna get to the bag so y'all stay tuned, cause I got you. Good morning, y'all. When I say last night was gone, I still got the makeup on my face. <sighs> I'm about to wash my ass, but. A dub, like a dub. But it is what it is, today is a new day. I ain't about to let that discourage me. It was just long, maybe like for nothing. I don't know, like, shout out, we looking out, but that's not the point, like, we came down here to get this bag, we didn't come down here for our men to then go handle business, we did, so with that being said, we're going to start it all over again, and we're going to handle business, because what's for us, is for us, and that's just that, okay, so if you haven't already, like, comment, and subscribe for real because why you watching you haven't even subscribed like make it make sense but yeah i'm a little down about that but it is what it is we're gonna um get to the bag like it was a good crowd but it was more like oh people performing and stuff like <clears throat> but it is what it is i'm going to a different club tonight um i ain't pulling the moment that club like it was packed it was good vibes and stuff but Baby, where's the point? So yeah, I'm about to um get up, get my life. I'm scared to even pull the button up. I was so tired, I crashed. Like I think cause I had drove and all that stuff too, but it is what it is. I'm about to get my life and I'm gonna come back and see y'all cause I think I want some Ruby Tuesday soon. Mm -hmm. I got a microwave too, so like when I, get back from work tonight and have some food but yeah stay tuned though and we back we back just like that um it's currently 12 38 um i checked out my hotel um i came down the street got me some ruby tuesdays because 
in North Carolina, baby, I think it's like three, maybe two, and they all like an hour and some away from me. So the fact that this Ruby Tuesdays was three minutes away from my hotel, baby, I'm going. And I'm eating. But um, I got some. What y'all begin from um, Ruby Tuesdays? I began um, spinach dip and the wings and fries. But I tell them to put like the garlic salt or it's. Um, some people do truffle. Like some places have like truffle salt. But have me scoop that shit up on your fries, baby. That shit is delicious. And I get um, blue cheese. I, I am a ranch kind of girl. But when I eat hot wings and stuff, I need, I need blue cheese. But yes. I'm about to take it to the crib. Um, I'd rather take an L at home and it be less of an L. And what I mean by that is like gas, hotel fee, all that shit, stuff. Sorry. All that stuff. Plus tip out. I'd rather pay $50 and, you know, hustle the $50 at home and be 30 minutes, 45 minutes away from my crib than three and a half hours away and only break even with my hotel fee. So, some, with this dance and shit, you definitely got to play it smart and keep it cute with things. Like, yeah, sometimes you can stick it out some, but and, you know, still make a bag or whatever. But sometimes you got to be smart with it because you can stay and make a bigger L than what you started out with just going back to the crib, you know. So, I know people be trying to, like, you know, oh, traveling is where it is, this and that, third, which it is. It's all 50-50 dancing. It's 50-50 gambling anyways. Like, you buying a scratch off in the, in the store is the same thing as you going to pay tip out at a club. You know what I'm saying? So, don't let it play on your mental. Don't let it play on your heart and what you got going on. Stay 10 toes down in everything you do. So, when you do, do what you do and, you know, handle business, you know that you tried your best and you did your all. Even if you don't succeed, maybe it wasn't your time right then. Like, I always had to think about it. Like, sometimes I knew the amount of money that I be touching now. The old Britney would have never would have never been able to handle that. Or I would have fumbled the back a lot. You know what I'm saying? So I feel like the universe put us in positions sometimes that we don't understand or or know how to deal with because we not we not mentally ready for what we asking for. You know what I'm saying? And I know like I'm still working on me. I'm still healing with things and everything. And I'm proud of that. I'm proud of me being able to open up my layers and my flaws and know like, okay, this is what's going on. This is this and this is that. So you know just learn yourself and don't be so hard on yourself that's definitely me i'm very hard and judgmental on myself because i want i expect so much more from me than anybody else i feel like which you should you know what i'm saying because it's you but at the end of the day you gotta realize sometimes the, the glass ain't always halfway empty that bitch halfway full too you know what i'm saying so baby chin up chest out we about to go to north carolina we about to put them shoes on again baby i got to lose some trains now because if i had the time but that's neither here nor there and we gonna get to it and if we do make what we want to you know make be satisfied with we did if we don't we don't we still made something and we able to you know continue to add on to the bag i definitely have to stop getting in my head with that like oh i didn't make a five i make five hundred dollars a night or da, 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 i got an attitude nah it is what it is you know what i'm saying shit happens what you gonna do now how you gonna act now Yeah, it's okay to be in your feelings, you know, be a little sad or whatever. But what you gonna do now? I always give myself a little grace period, you know, a little time. Okay, get it out. <laughs> Cry, get it out. Do what you gotta do now. What you gonna do? What's the plan? Better get into it. So, yeah, I'm about to head back to the Cribbiana. I'll probably go to the after hours tonight just so I can lay down and chill. Take me a little nap. Y'all got my face waxed. And I swear to God, I think that shit breaking me the fuck out. Like, I'm breaking out like I'm 16 and I'm just about to get my period or something. No cap, but. And I use all natural stuff. I have, um, I did just get off birth control. I was on birth control for eight years, y'all. The whole time, I just found out you don't need supposed to be on birth control that long. The type of, the type of birth control I had, like. Bro, make sure y'all really sit down and talk to y'all doctors about things and do your own research because doctors tell you things and do things too because they get paid, bro. Especially with black women, like, look into that shit. You'd be surprised how, how much profit they get off of of um black women or black or black female, um, black females coming in for certain things and they push this on to you or oh you gotta take this medicine this and that there you'd be surprised you'd be surprised the statistics about things when it comes to those pharmaceutical sales bro tell me 
read and do your research and that's why i change i'm changing my eating habits i change i even changed girl down to my toothpaste everything in my household is natural and i'm trying to go ahead by next year summertime for us to either transition to either be you know at least halfway through like vegetarian or either you know vegan a little bit i'm just really trying to cut out i ain't even trying to put no name on i really want to cut out meat um i know chicken gonna be the hardest thing because baby i love chicken but i want to cut out meat and i really want to stick to like um organic natural things like i'm about to start gardening and shit like i got a lot of shit for y'all because your health is the main important thing like bro get in check with your body bro no cap listen to it because your body gonna tell you exactly what it needs and when you craving certain things like when you crave sugar or people be like oh, i want a soda i want some chocolate or something like that look it up because your body is really craving for something else like when you crave chocolate and shit it'd be like you your low iron or something it may not be you know that for that but i'm saying like when it's saying you craving sugar you need you need potassium when you craving whatever you crave you you need this so it's 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 shit that it's for but we ain't about to get into that. I'm just about to tell y'all. I just had to. I had just had to tell y'all what the fuck was going on with that because, as I'm speaking to y'all, I be speaking to me too. Because, girl, stand up. It's okay. It's okay. And and that's that's what it is. So, when I come back, I will be in North Carolina, probably in my bed and still shake that ass in the club because it's about how you carry yourself. You get what I'm saying? But that's another story for another day, baby. So I'm about to eat on my food a little bit. Some of, I already ate some of this finished dude. Let me see, let me show y'all. These are motherfucking fries I was telling y'all about. And I, child, look at my little, look at my little crudles. These supposed to be boneless buffalo wings. I don't know what, buffalo things. I don't know what it looks like that, but it's finished up. Schmack. She was by there. And they put like some season on it. Girl, give me some. Give me the fuck song. Y'all, when I say I came home, I got to North Carolina and got in the bed, baby, I was knocked out. So, I do want to apologize that y'all did not see a money count in this video, but I do have a booking coming up for the next vlog, so stay tuned. This video, let's drop some white hearts just because I had that platinum silver hair going on, baby, and stay tuned because I got something for y'all.